Well, I guess it's official. I am now Brother Jevons because my good friend, Reverend Peter Popoff, has written me another letter. That's right, again, to Mike British Jevons, which is, I guess now, my name. But uh, what complete delights could this one contain? I just, I'm so excited. First thing I feel I should point out is uh, second class post, Peter. Not sure God would approve of that, would he? Hmm. Cheapskate. Right. Uh, looks like we have a piece of dishcloth or something, or a nice tea cosy. Let's save that for later. So, oh, another return envelope. He wants us to send something back. Oh, and just loads of rubbish. Here we go. Okay. Dear Brother Jevons, see, it's official. It is official. Let me tell you what happened in one of my crusades. Oh, he's a crusader. It's amazing. I was ministering in the spirit, and I suddenly felt led to give this dear lady an anointed handkerchief. Is that what this is? Is this seriously a handkerchief? It feels awful. And you can look at that. You can see through it. You can read the letter <laughs> through it. That is not catching anybody's snot, even when they've got a light cold. Come on. I reached in my pocket to get my handkerchief, and I didn't have one. So I looked at Elizabeth. Who's Elizabeth? I'm guessing that's the old lady. Who knows? And asked her if I could borrow hers, and she gave me her lady's handkerchief. Ah, oh, the exact handkerchief. This is some sort of relic then, isn't it, really? This is worth millions. Cheers, Pete. When I put Elizabeth's miracle handkerchief... Since when has it been upgraded to a miracle handkerchief now? In the lady's hand, she said she was instantly healed. Wait, who the fuck is Elizabeth? Is Elizabeth not the old lady now? Oh, whatever. I've read it in the Bible. I've read it again and again. I prayed about it, and I feel that my wife... Oh, this is a... Okay, this is wife. Thanks for, uh, thanks for establishing character late on there, Pete. Cheers. Elizabeth and I should loan you this powerful handkerchief for a need you have in your life there in Berkhamsted. As I prayed, I felt that I am, op I am to open this door of opportunity to you. Super duper. Brother Jevons, I've been in special prayer for you and someone close to you. I was burned by you and other certain prayer partners, and I went to great effort to get this miracle lady's handkerchief to you there at P.O. Bar okay, whatever. I was very concerned. This is absolutely ridiculous. Keep sending... Keep seeding? Keep... What the hell does that say? God's blessing closer? I don't know. Right, let's skip ahead a few. This is getting a bit uh, strange. Now, okay, what? Now here is what Acts verses 11 and 12 say to you, my dear brother Jevons. This is... Oh, it's my scripture! It's mine! Nobody else in the world would have been sent this. And God wrought special miracles by hands of Paul. That's the name of my uh, stepfather. So uh, I'm going to be having words with him later. Print your name by faith in the centre of this blessed... Okay, so I'm going to have to get a pen. Then open your Bible. Don't have one. Now lay this anointed miracle lady's handkerchief with your name printed on it on this scripture. Leave it there for tonight only. No letting... Telling what God, God is going to cause to come up. Jesus, that sounds absolutely terrifying. I'm a little bit scared. Uh, again, so... Got to send another £27. Mm. Try your best. Okay. Okay, there's nothing on that one. So, what do we have here? Dear Brother Popoff. So, he's, what, writing to himself now, or...? Oh, I get it. This is the one I have to send back to him with my, uh, check spelt incorrectly. Hmm. Okay, thank you for having Elizabeth loan the Bible lady's handkerchief to me. I'm sending it back. I believe God for my miracle. I'm signing my name and the name of my loved one on the Bible's handkerchief. Bible lady's handkerchief. Oh, I don't even care anymore. This day will bless you. Okay. Right, just, uh, holy crap. I can send £27 other. I am the one. I will give you a hundred and ninety-one pounds and eleven pence. Are you... 
Is he seriously asking people for £191? It, this thing is full of £27, but £191? That is absolutely disgusting. Absolutely awful. Okay. All right, Pete. All right, Pete, I'm going to get a pen, I think. I'm going to get a pen, and I'm going to sign my name on your handkerchief. Well, I'm afraid I don't have a pen, so I'm just going to have to compromise. I'm going to have to use uh, tomato ketchup. So, if I can... Uh, M... I... K... Whoops. I can't uh, go making any mistakes for Jesus and... Uh, Good old bro I'll put a kiss, just to be nice. There we go. So, there is my uh, letter. I'm going to send it back to... Uh, I'm just going to linger on that uh, PO Box address for a second there. Oh, it's free post! It won't cost you anything to send anything there. Just saying. So, let's just fold this up nicely. Oh, this is uh, making a little bit of a mess. It's going to be a shame. It's going to be a shame for whoever opens that. Oh, that's a pungent aroma. Don't really want to lick that, so I'm just going to uh, improvise a little bit. Come on, there we go. Just, uh, just wet that along there a little bit. Oh, my hand's all dirty. Okay. There we go. So, I'm going to send that back to, uh, to Pete. Brother Pete, my bro. Yo, dog. There we go, that's what kids do. So yes, I'm going to pop this in the post and hopefully I'll get something back from my brother. Lovely.